Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. When the Buddha was alive, he has many disciples, and even his disciples can work miracles. And Jesus promised his disciples that whatever he does, they can do the same. Therefore, we owe it to mankind to practice the way Christ did, the way Buddha did. And because I owe it to mankind to attain what I have attained today, I have to share it with you. <laughs> I'm happy to share it with you. Please stay with us to find out more. Supreme Master Ching Hai's lectures are not a complete meditation instruction. Please do not try alone. For free of charge guidance, please visit godsdirectcontact.org or contact any of our centers near you. Today's program will be presented in English with subtitles in Arabic, our Lhasis, also known as Vietnamese, Chinese, Czech, Dutch, English, French, German, Hebrew, Hindi, Hungarian, Indonesian, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Mongolian, Persian, Polish, Portuguese, Punjabi, Romanian, Russian, Spanish, Thai, Turkish, and Urdu. Hello, marvelous viewers. I'm Sekyong from Environmentally Friendly Singapore. The conscientious people of Singapore send you love and sincere greetings. Located at one of the crossroads of the world, Singapore's strategic position has helped her grow into a major centre for trade, communications and tourism. Today, Singapore proudly has one of the world's busiest ports, best airports and cleanest city environments. Singapore is also well known around the world as a garden city. Though there are many glittering skyscrapers, there's a lot of greenery along the roadsides and around the island. This is attributed to the continuous effort of the Singapore government in planting trees and beautifying the environment. Singapore's uniqueness stems from a harmonious blend of ethnicity and traditions. The immigrants of the past have given her wonderful citizens of Malay, Chinese, Indian and European descent, among others. Each group has its own distinctive culture and there are colourful festivals of special significance year-round enjoyed by all. The open-minded Singaporean people have warmly received Supreme Master Ching Hai's presence and her illuminating spiritual lectures many times. We now invite you to listen to the final part of the lecture titled Create a Permanent Heaven for Yourself and Later Generations given by Supreme Master Ching Hai in Singapore on March 3rd, 1992. When the Buddha was alive, he has many disciples, and even his disciples can work miracles. And Jesus promised his disciples that whatever he does, they can do the same. Therefore, we owe it to mankind to practice the way Christ did, the way Buddha did. And because I owe it to mankind to attain what I have attained today, I have to share it with you. <laughs> I'm happy to share it with you. Whoever likes to share it, 
I'm happy to devote my time, my attention, my energy, even my health, my finance to you without any uh, request in return, except that you work for it, for the benefit of yourself and for the world that we live in. I have lived in this world for 42 years. I have owed you all many things. I owe you your love, your food, your clothes, your education, that I can speak English, that I can speak Chinese, that I grow up up till now. I owe you the building of the hotels I stay, of the roads I walk on, of the beautiful beach that I enjoy. I owe you everything. Therefore, I would like to repay this kindness to all of you. This is only a duty, so no need to feel obliged to me. Only if you want to learn, I'm too happy and grateful. <laughs> so now we have uh, discussed about two kinds of heaven. <laughs> one is temporary and one is eternal. And should you like to choose one of them, of course we're happy to help you. And it's not that I will come today and then live tomorrow only, but I will stay with you forever. After the initiation, you have insight help and protection, and outside contact also. Inside is that when you meditate, you will see maybe the Master, you may see Buddha helping you, or you may see lights, or you might feel good, comfortable, blissful. You will feel your wisdom grow more and more each day. Your love expands infinitely. That is when you know the method is successful, is very useful. Otherwise, how do you measure? If everyone just tell you to do anything, <laughs> then you just uh, close your eyes and believe it, and you have no proof. Proof we must give you, proof you must demand. And you will have that at the time of initiation, immediately, and continue afterward, every day. You will experience miracles for yourselves when you are in trouble, when you are in accidents, when you have nowhere to turn to, that when you know God power, that's how you love God, that's how you know God, that's how you know that there is Buddha, there is God who protects you, who loves you. Otherwise, how do you know? How do we know that there is God? What is the use of God <laughs> when, when we don't see Him or we don't see the protection and help when we are in need? We don't ask Him to come every day, maybe, but when we need, we must feel that somebody is there. So that's how you worship God even more as a Christian after practicing Guan Yin Method. That's how you become a better Buddhist and more grateful to the Buddha, because we know what Buddha is now. We see, we feel, we experience the protection, the blessing power in every time of our life. Up to now, we only stay outside. We don't even know where the door is to knock. But after initiation, we step in, become a member of this blissful community, powerful sainthood, and we experience God. Then we know. Otherwise, we pray every day. If we don't see God, we feel discouraged. We don't feel God when in time of need, our faith is keep shaking, wavering all the time. That's why I offer you this method, so that you know there is God, you know there is Buddha, and you can be more devoted to God. You can be more convinced in your faith, in whatever faith you have. You do not need to change your God. You do not, do not need to trade Buddha for for God, believe whatever you believe, but get in touch with it, and we show you how, because you have him inside. You just don't know where to push the button, that's all. <laughs> it is like in any other science, you have to know. Just know where to push the button. Transfer yourself from darkness to light. Push the button, and you are there. Just like many kind of transportation in this world, 
we use bicycle, takes <laughs> take too long. Uh, we use uh, boat, they take a little bit faster. We use airplane, it's faster. But there are other airplanes which are faster still, and there are even UFOs. We will have in the future, when we can afford to buy it from the next planet, for example, <laughs> where they produce UFOs to sell. Mm. But for the moment, they dare not come. <laughs> and they worry that we, we will kill them. Mm. We might kill them by love, not by hatred even, because we don't know yet how to take care of them. We might put, put them in the laboratories and cut them to have a look, see what contains inside. Yeah. Or we might give them penicillins to avoid AIDS, for example, which they don't have. <laughs> Oh, give all kind of vaccinations, and they get sick before they even know what sickness is. Yeah, so they came healthy to our planet and return sick or die. Therefore, they are still uh, very hesitant to come to establish business with us. Yeah. But we will do it maybe in the future when all of the earthling consciousness are uplifted, a civilized when we all think in a broader sense, broader scale, when we think of the whole galaxy, the whole universe, expands our consciousness and understanding and intelligence, instead of thinking of only of our house, our country, or our village, then we'll be ready for this kind of intergalactic communication. Then we will learn more, and we will grow faster, and we will have more and more and more comfort to life. We have everything we want, and we can share everything we have, and share everything other, other planets have with us to better our lives, to build a better world for our children. This will come. This will come. But we must train ourselves in this way of broad thinking. This is a way of a gentleman. Even the Buddha, Christ, 2,500 years ago. They already have such a broad thinking. He preached not of the earth, but of Amitabha, pure land, western paradise, eastern paradise. And Christ, he preached not from earth, not of the earth, but of heaven. My father's, my father's mansion has so many mansions. He means so many planets, so many levels of consciousness that he can lead us to. We have to think this way. We have to think like the Buddha, like Christ. We have to broaden our, our look. We have to hope big and high for the future. And we start right now. We can see even other planets right now with the Kuan Yin Method. We can contact other beings right now with the Kuan Yin Method. If, if we don't want to do it yet, it's okay, but we must bear in mind that such things are possible. I have seen it, my disciples have, why not you? And now, at least try your best to pacify our world, to purify our world by uh, living a purer life, a more moral standard of life, and try to put down the meat diet, because it contains a killing instinct. And the violent films and all that, try not to let your children watch too much. The more we watch these violent films, the more we are stunned, the more we are insensitive to the suffering of people when they're killed, or animals when they're killed. In one country, it is experienced that the soldiers of that country were reluctant to kill the enemy, enemies. But when they are shown the violent films and they see all the killing in the films, they later become insensitive, become less reluctant to kill, and they're more ready to kill the enemies. And it is also known that the soldiers of who are fed more with meat and all that, they are more, more ready to combat. They're more furious. 
And these soldiers, they, they don't even watch that many violent films, mm. not as much as our children do on uh, television. So do not uh, <laughs> try to avoid the parents' responsibility by sit the children in front of the television and turn on any kind of program. Try to play with them, teach them moral from childhood. And when they grow up, you don't fear that they become bad children and make you worry. In the old times, when you were young, or when my father or my grandfather were young, moral lessons were a kind of compulsory, natural in our class, in the schools. Nowadays, less and less. Therefore, the children grows up, grow up and having all kind of bad influences instead of having a very good ethical root from childhood. When the tree has a good root in the earth, when it grows up, it doesn't uh, fall down easily. But when the tree is not rooted well, it just grows up a little bit and then it gets broken down by winds or other natural force. I feel everyone is my brothers. I cannot identify myself with any nation. I feel at ease with Singapore people or with Malaysian, uh, Chinese, uh, German, in English, and Americans, everywhere. I feel at home. Hmm. Actually, the world is a big house where God gave different children different rooms. And actually, we should be free to walk from one room to the next to see our brothers and sisters. But sometimes we put barriers between the nations. And some people, for some um, fanatical reason, breed even barriers between religions, maybe because of ignorance or maybe for personal gain. All this should be erased, should be changed, if we want to live in a better world. You know what happened today. There was a German, a friend of, of our disciple, Mm, he came last night, about past midnight, to bring us some type machine and a fax machine because we did not bring with us, and the fax machine that our disciple brought broke down. So after midnight, and even he just had a baby and he works all day long, he brought it to us because he knew we work for the people. Yeah, for the refugees and the poor and all that. And I work after midnight even because of this urgent work. Sometimes the, the information comes in or the demand so fast, so I have to work even midnight or all night with my disciple. And we didn't have the time to buy the machine, so he brought it in and he even offered it to us. And, if, and he wasn't even my disciple. We wanted to offer him money back because we never take things uh, for free like this when we didn't do anything for people. But he said, no. Uh, because we work for others, not for ourselves, so we no need to bother. Of course, we will give some present in return, but I was very touched. And I feel that the non-disciple people also deserve my attention. Therefore, today I decided that I will teach you more advanced methods, provided you have time, and that you let me have you further later, then I will teach you. Otherwise, if you just practice alone, I don't know what happened to you, and you will not know how to uh, cope further should something arise. In this way, I feel responsible, because the advanced method, you cannot teach it at random, and then leave people just halfway through. Therefore, I have to tell you this, and it's the first time I open this. And for the people who are more serious and want to advance quickly on the spiritual path, have to be vegetarian fully from today. And I wish you, your country, your people, your government, all the best possible blessing from God. Thank you.
luminous viewers, we appreciate you being with us today for Words of Wisdom. Coming up next is Notre Dame de Paris, breathtakingly majestic Gothic Cathedral, part three of three, right after noteworthy news. Please stay tuned to Supreme Master Television. May your life flourish by the blessings of your faith. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash WOW. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com bar oblique schedule et suprememastertv.com bar oblique WOW. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com bar inclinada schedule et suprememastertv.com bar inclinada WOW. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Accesse suprememastertv.com tv.com barra schedule e suprememastertv.com barra w-o-w हमारे कार्यक्रम पेश किए जाते हैं कई भाषाओं में कृपया देखें suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule और suprememastertv.com forward slash w-o-w हमारे जेमो तीकों दो जोंग यूएन चिन कान suprememastertv.com शेशें schedule और suprememastertv.com शेशें w-o-w रंजांगन कमी मनावल कंबाइन्या भाषा सेला कुंजोंगी suprememastertv.com slash gaharapan schedule दान suprememastertv.com slash gaharapan w-o-w और हमें जो नाम तवा फिरा बिल आदि दिमिनल Наши программы предлагает много языков. Пожалуйста, посмотрите suprememastertv.com касачерта schedule и suprememastertv.com касачерта w-o-w. Та программата о нас просверите се по лес глазис. Паракалюме дейте suprememastertv.com касачерта schedule και supermastertv.com κάθετος WOW.